Doctor, my friend is being treated with neoadjuvant therapy for lung cancer. Could you please tell me all about this? Well, I understand that you want to know more about lung cancer. So, you know, whenever a patient comes in little advanced disease, like a stage 2 disease or stage 3 disease, I as a surgeon would not be accepting that patient for surgery straight away. The reason for that is these cancers, these lung cancers in stage 2 and stage 3 do better when we give them chemotherapy before doing surgery. So for that reason, we give a few chemotherapies, a few cycles of chemotherapies before we offer them surgery. And that is the concept of neoadjuvant chemotherapy. It means to give chemotherapy before a surgery. Surgery being a very important part of lung cancer treatment or, and a only curative part of lung cancer treatment, our final aim is surgery itself. So to understand more about it, how we are going to do it, what do we mean by neoadjuvant chemotherapy, my colleague Dr. Suresh Babu will be answering you. The neoadjuvant therapy of lung cancer is basically given in the form of chemotherapy or in combination with radiotherapy. It is basically given to make the patient prepare for a definitive treatment, definitive treatment in the form of surgery or maybe in the form of radiation. So what neoadjuvant therapy does is it is going to be reduce the burden of disease. When the burden of disease is going to reduce, it will make the the person to make definitive treatment much easier. For example, if you have reduced the burden of the cancer, the surgery can be formed in a much better way and much easier way. So, neoadjuvant chemotherapy is usually used in advanced lung cancers to reduce the burden of the disease so that the patient is much better prepared for the local form of treatment, either in the form of surgery or in the form of radiotherapy. That's about neoadjuvant treatment.